Hi, my name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys,
You opened my case. Listen, I'm going to need you to trust me. Mommy will get 
get things started. Obey the rules, or I'll tear you apart and eat your insides while you're still alive. <laughs> Crazy strong and smart you are. Follow Mommy Long Legs down the stairs and we'll start by playing musical memory. See you in a bit. Welcome to Musical Memory. This advanced memory and cognitive recognition test is designed to stimulate several segments of the brain, allowing us to see how quickly and efficiently your brain works. A sequence of colors will be shown, and you must recreate the exact sequence using the buttons around you. Bunzo will slowly lower towards you. When you complete a color pattern correctly, Bunzo will rise back up. When you input a pattern incorrectly, Bunzo will lower towards you faster. If Bunzo reaches you, your test is over. 
the test will become more difficult as it continues, with longer patterns in quicker succession. That's all. Good luck.
permission to be this smart. <laughs> Mommy is super proud of you, but I'm sure she's already told you that herself. Our next game is Waggo Wuggy. Head downstairs and have fun. Welcome to Wacka Wuggy. This advanced test is designed to assess the extent of your reactionary abilities. A dual palm grab pack will be provided to you for this test. Around you are 18 sizable holes. An adorable Huggy Wuggy toy could appear out of any one of these holes. If one comes out, hit it with your grab pack. That's all. Good luck. The toys in this game used to have strings attached to them, so they could be pulled back when they got too close to the children. Hmm. Have fun. another hint for you.
Seems like you're ready for the final game, statues. Follow mommy down the stairs one last time. I hope you had a fun day at the game station. See you next time. Welcome to Statues. This advanced obstacle course is designed to test your physical endurance and strength. The rules are simple. The lights will turn off. You can move through the obstacle course at this time. However, when the lights turn on, you can look around but cannot move. You may move again once the lights turn back off. The lovable PJ Pugapillar will follow you. If PJ reaches you, your test is over. That's all. Good luck. It was always so sad to see the kids go. They called me Mommy because I was the closest thing they ever had to one. But they come for games and never come back. They left Mommy to die alone. Mommy didn't deserve that. But you, you worked here. So if anyone deserves to die alone,
Good. I'll board the train. We need to leave.
Hello. My name is Elliot Ludwig. When you look around at the world today, what one thing do you think it needs more of? I asked around once. Money, I never have enough. Understanding, I can never get any. Faith, the common man has lost it. Each answer was different. And I could perhaps see some little truth in each. But I think each was also missing something. Something simple. You see, not one of them could muster a smile. A smile is hope. A smile is love. A smile is understanding. And there is nothing more gratifying to my soul than being the reason for a child's smile. To be the spark that ignites all their hopes and dreams. For it is only through hopes and dreams that we may create a better world. One where our children need not be afraid. One where they are protected. After all, this company and its toys are nothing without them. These children deserve to smile, they deserve to love, and they deserve a safe home. That is why it is with enormous pleasure that as the founder of Playtime Co., I announce... Playcare, our very own on-site orphanage. But it's not only that, it's a school a playhouse, a place to belong. Our very own ecosystem beneath the surface, dedicated in every inch and detail to ensuring a child's smile. It's teachers and counselors, mothers and fathers, until such a time they have all of that in you. May play care bring joy, inspiration, and smiles to all who enter these doors. But what gives life its meaning if not a smile? It's me again, Ali. Cool place, right? The kids used to live here. Now look at it. Anyways, do you see that statue in the middle of the room? Take the stairs that go under it. There's a really cool that powers literally all of Playcare. I can give you a key down there. So, you got the key. Now the question you're probably asking yourself is, where does it go? Well, head back out, and you should find a door just to the left of the cable car you took down here.
Tragic news this morning as of 9.45 a.m. Local authorities report that the following, following recent events, Playtime Co. was asked for any comment regarding the discovery. This is what they had to say. Quote, it's sickening. Elliot Ludwig was a great man, and those who knew him understood that he was not capable of violence, let alone what others now claim. He had a deep love in his heart. Despite Playtime's proclamation of Ludwig's innocence, many of the members of the Greetings, employees, and welcome to your first day here in Playtime. We're certain that in the days to come, you'll find your new family here every bit as loving and supportive as your own. Feel free to wander the halls, sit in the mess for lunch, or watch our children play and learn to their little heart's content. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed. Or join the counselors of Playcare whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your part in that future, so should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are, or what you've done, worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And, should you come back years later, your conscience finally getting the better of you, May you descend into the dark and the dust, finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. Perhaps they'd smile at you from a shadow, their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic, watching and waiting patiently for their turn at a warm welcome. Or perhaps they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world you'd left, a world that's theirs now. Welcome home.
here to help <sighs> this place makes her tense I'm glad that Ollie could help you get this far he's the reason we found you at all looks like the train crash hurt us both <sighs> you've been through so much you deserve an explanation come on Be okay. We'll be okay. you leave what's happening down here is bigger than all of us and I need you so we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you who've tortured us they didn't act alone they're disciples of the original the prototype do the honors Prototype knows we're coming by now. You try to escape, 
He'll kill you before you ever reach that front door. He's the reason I was trapped in that god-awful case for so long. You have no idea of the things he's done. Let me help you kill him. Let me help you save everyone. We've all seen you. How capable you are. You killed Huggy. You killed Mommy. You freed me. You are perfect for this. Catnap is coming. He's the final obstacle the prototype has placed against us. You can't stay here. Keep yourself safe. Ollie will call you. Speaking. Please excuse the interruption. Students, remain in your seat until the bell has rung. And wait, I recognize you. Yes, I remember. You used to work here. How are you? Alive. Hmm? Barb? Oh. Barb says you're looking for your co workers. Catnap wouldn't like that you're here. You should leave, for your own safety. Good listener, are you? You're a lot like the other humans in that way. I wonder if your screams will sound like theirs too. <laughs> I look forward to finding out.
You're a Papi's angel. Come to save us. Nothing left to save. Not here. Herb catnaps from angel. There, home. A million pairs of eyes are on you now. Watching. Waiting. Hungry. They want nothing more than to crawl beneath your skin and eat away at you bit by little bit. <laughs> Fill what feels empty inside themselves. That thing. Catnap. The prototype is his god, and this is what he does to heretics. These little toys follow Catnap to avoid that very fate. And in return, they are fed. <clears throat> we try to fight it. The prototypes control. I am the last of the smiling critters. Listen to me. You need to get out of this place. You need to live. You and Poppy could fix this. End this madness. The torment. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me. Please. Just go. Run.
what's happened here?
Good, you're here. And you've done it again. The impossible. Just like I knew you would. Catnap's gone. The red smoke is diverted. Everything is falling into place, thanks to you. But if we're to keep going with them, then you deserve to have the truth. You came back because of your co-workers. You want to know what happened. And why? This. This is your answer. We called it the Hour of Joy. was all over. They dragged those corpses down below where they'd never be found. And they ate the bodies to stay alive. The prototype has to die for this. For everything. As we reach the bottom, we'll send the lift back up. Just hold tight, okay? After you! <sighs> Alright. Once we hit the ground, we need to be cautious. There's something... Now we're going to rescue you. Survive. Escape while we descend. We'll be up the elevator soon. When you get down, head straight to the cable area and take the elevator up. 
Be careful always. We're almost in the laboratory in the mall area. Just hurry up and rescue Kissy. What's happening with the elevator? and just take it easy. I'm sick of you guys being incompetent. Another factory is doing a better job, and you here will slowly reduce the rest time by 10 minutes daily. Come on, get to work, or I'll fire you idiots. Just rest. Huggy get some rest, we'll find Kissy soon. Very good, Huggy. This way he will learn not to mess with us, but to harm and all he will call you. Hello. Well, Huggy will take me somewhere name. else we all want to be. The prototype deserves when you look to around die all the, the suffering. Today, Though we what can't one you. thing do you think it needs more? I asked around once. Money. I never have enough. Understanding. I can never get any. Faith. The common man has lost it. Each answer was different. And I could perhaps see some little truth in each. But I think each was also missing something. Something simple. You see, not one of them could muster a smile. A smile is hope. A smile is love. A smile is understanding. And there is nothing more gratifying to my soul than being the reason for a child's smile. To be the spark that ignites all their hopes and dreams. For it is only through hopes and dreams that we may create a better world. One where our children need not be afraid. One where they are protected. After all, this company and its toys are nothing without them. These children deserve to smile, they deserve to love, and they deserve a safe home.
Playtime Co. Security Log 0, 1, 2, 5. Entry to front lobby, reached by unknown intruder. A tale like this always starts simple. A mystery about a toy factory whose staff all vanished a decade prior. Well, almost all. It was dusk when the intruder broke into the factory. Its main lobby provided a warm welcome for all. But these days, it is an old forgotten thing. It didn't take our lone intruder long before the first voice of the factory rose over the silence. Got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. They ignored the warning, of course. Stealing a Playtime Co. grab pack, once used by staff and invented by the elusive company founder, Elliot Ludwig. The next creation our guest encountered was none other than Playtime mascot, Huggy Wuggy. He loomed over the foyer with a wide, vacant smile. Weaker people would have laughed at that point. And yet, this intruder progressed down, kicking up pieces of the distant past in their descent. A pretty great feeling too. <laughs> and this is where the fun began. Our intruder stirred one of the factory's security measures, and he performed exactly as he was designed. Our intruder scrambled through ventilation ducts with Huggy not far behind. The ventilation in this place has always been a maze. It's impressive this intruder made it through at all. Eventually, they made their way into an open warehouse, narrowly avoiding a collapsing catwalk that sent our dear Huggy plummeting into the depths below. They lingered on the catwalks. <laughs> Science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not.